Hello everyone, my name is Ian Lamont. I'm the author of Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes. And today I'm going to be talking about printing in Google Drive and Google Docs. And this may seem like a basic question. Um, you know, you just want to print out a document. Maybe you need it for homework or for a report or whatever. But uh, there's some difficulties in getting it done. And I'm going to explain what the difficulties are and then also how to get around some of these particular issues. Now, the first thing that I see happen a lot with people who are trying to print out a Google Docs document is they end up with something like this. This is a Google Docs file. It's from a homework assignment. And at the top of the screen, there are some extra information appearing in the header. So the title appears here, and then also a URL appears up here. And of course, when you're printing out a homework assignment or a report, you don't want that these things to appear in the header. And the question is, first of all, why does this happen? And then the second question is, how do I get rid of them? So uh, here, here's what is happening in most cases when you see something like this. And when you go to Google Docs and you're trying to print a document, a lot of times people, instead of printing from the print button, which is right here, they go up to the top of the screen to the file menu and they print from there. So this is actually printing from the browser and then they select this. And when you do that, oftentimes the, uh, in the header, you'll get something like the title of the file as well as the URL. And to, to get around that, of course, instead of printing from the browser, whether it's Firefox or Internet Explorer or Chrome, you print from here. This button that's right on the toolbar, you click print, and then you'll be given some options to print it out. And when it comes out, it won't have that information in the header. Now, this also brings us to the second issue that comes up when people are trying to print, and they don't have an option to actually print to a printer, sometimes even if it's hooked up to the computer. And this can be very frustrating, but fortunately, there's usually a workaround to it. And one thing that you, uh, when you come here and you see something like an option, it just says save as PDF or print to PDF, there's no other option, to, a visible option to print to a printer. Click the change button if there is one and see if that won't print, give you an option to print to some other printer. So here I've done that and there's all these local destinations and I can choose one of them. And then when I print this, when I hit print, yes, it will print it out uh, on the local printer. Now, if you don't have any option to print locally, there's still something you can do. And one of them is just to save it as a PDF and then print it out later. So sometimes it will give you the option to open the PDF in a preview, or it'll just say save to PDF. And what you do then is you'll, you'll save the PDF document to your hard drive somewhere. Then you'll open it up in another program. And maybe that program is Adobe Acrobat, or it's in, if you're using a Mac, it's the preview program. But then from preview or Adobe Acrobat or whatever other piece of software you're using, you can print from that to your local printer. So anyways, these are some common printing issues and some ways to get around it. But the most important thing to remember is when you're printing, don't print from the browser up here. Don't do that. Print from the button that's right there or print from the file menu inside Google Docs and choose print. Uh, finally, one last thing. If you need to change the orientation, go to the file menu in Google Docs, click page setup, and then you can switch between portrait and landscape. You can mess around with the margins. You can change the paper size and all sorts of other stuff. So I hope that's been helpful to you. If you want more tips and tricks on how to use Google Drive, Google Docs, Google Sheets, or Google Slides, check out my book available from in30minutes.com. Thanks for watching.